So in today's trip, we're out here uh, in France at Lake Gigantica. Uh, the aim, the uh, today's plan, I should say, is going to be going after some big carp. Three rods set out then. We've got these spot mix out there waiting, hopefully, for some action in this first spot. I will include the locations for each of the pegs that we try today and hopefully we're going to have a good run. Okay, rod two then has all lit up at this first peg. The curve bends over on our number two rod and we've got our first fish on. Always some mighty carp at Gigantica. You've got the chance of catching and hopefully that's going to be the case today as we pull in our first fish up the rung. And we're going to see that we've got a nice mirror on there at 24 pounds and 7 ounces. Next fish on then. That feels like a good one that's pulling. That is getting out there. Let's try and work this thing back in. Keep just pumping that rod, just trying to bring this fish in now. Looks like a good size. It has been fighting uh, very, very well. Come on. Well, you're just sitting here bringing in these uh, car. Let's take it out of you. And oh my God, that is an absolute tank of a carp. Could that be a boss? It has to be. Yeah, white lines, boss fish, 51 pounds and an ounce on uh, 20 mil tiger nuts on rod number three. That is an absolute tank of a fish, as I said. And uh, a great way to get us underway here at Gigantica with our first boss, uh, boss part of me, fish. Let's take a look at the setup quickly. Uh, Haichu Serpent 10 foot rods, Sonic Vader X reels, 80 pound braid, of course, and uh, crank rig number two hooks across all three rods. Uh, we're running Monster Red 18 mils, CR1 bottom baits 18 mils, uh, and then as you just saw, uh, Tiger Nuts on 20 mils on rod number three. Waiting then for more action down here in this corner and see some fish again that oh and we've got the rod cracked off more action once more that rod gets bent over and we've got another decent fish on look at the belly on that thing even though he's about i don't know how far out 30 feet 40 feet out you can already see that is a good size Let's get to battle with this thing and uh, see if we can bring him in. Okay, this fish continues to fight. It's another solid carp, and I would say possibly we're on here for maybe another boss because he is taking line once more. He's getting out there, but the fight has been ongoing, and I feel like anytime soon he is actually coming in at a pretty good pace now. Are we going to land this thing? Yes, we are as he turns over. And oh my God, look at the gut on that thing. That is a monster. It's Galaxy, the name fish, 71 pounds and 15 ounces. Uh, rod two, they're doing the job with those CR1 bottom baits. 71 pounds. An absolute corker of a carp and that's exactly the reason why we're fishing here on Gigantica in this video. Okay, reset of the rods and already we are back in the action again as the CR1 bottom baits on rod two have just taken off. And what is the feeling of this thing? Is this, I don't know, it feels like a good fish, but it's not running straight away been a decent fight with this fish it sort of half feels like a boss fish half not just could be something towards the top end of the spectrum but it hasn't been an easy fight for this carp we are hopefully going to get this thing in yeah here we go as it comes right in close 
That's got to be a boss, right? It has to be. Yeah, nude fish. Nude fish, 52 pounds on the nose. CL1 bottom baits, 18 mil on rod two, doing the job once again. We're in the action once more. And it's another fish out on that far bank towards the left. Again, this feels good. We're just getting so much action in this first spot. It's crazy. Come on then, this fight has been ongoing now for a couple of minutes. Already three awesome boss fish secured in this first, first spot, part of me. Are we gonna get super lucky here and have a fourth one? This thing's turning over, it's gonna come in now, we have got it. Oh, come on, is that Marcel's? I can't think which one it is. It is Marcel's, Monster Red Boy, he's 18 mil on that first rod, 50 pound and 12 ounces. Our fourth boss fish in this first peg. Absolutely love to see it, what a tank of a fish. An absolutely brilliant run on this first peg. Uh, let's switch over to the lay of the lake here on Gigantica. We're in this bottom right corner in the big girls swim, not at the peg directly in front of you when you spawn, but the first peg to the left as you walk down the path. Um, that's where we've got set up, fishing in this left-hand margin, and it's been brilliant. We're off then to the second peg. We've got our throwing stick out, throwing some extra run monster red boilies out, and as we're doing that, one of our rods is cracked off, and we're in the action here at our second spot. Good fight for this first fish on our second peg. Is that a little common there? Yeah, a little common carp. CL1 bottom baits, 22 pounds and 11 ounces. Our next carp on. Start to wear this thing down now. Can't be out there for much longer. It's put up a bit of a fight, but it doesn't feel anything too special. Yeah, it's another common on those 20 wheel tiger nuts. Good fish on now though. This feels like a decent one. Pulling off down that left hand side. Uh, it's starting to take some line. This is a good fish. Could we have another boss on the line? Well, it's been an ongoing fight now for the last sort of five or six minutes, trying to reel this thing in. It's got to be getting worn down pretty soon, I would say. Starting to turn over. It is losing some energy. We might get it here. And that has to be another boss fight there, doesn't it? Yeah, Mr. Angry, boss fish, monster red boy is again on rod one, 60 pounds and four ounces here at this second peg. Absolute tank. I'm absolutely not to see it. Let's head over again to the lay of the lake here and you can see we've moved up to the stink swim and we're fishing at the peg directly in front of you as you come to this spot. And uh, another boss fish secured at this second peg here on Gigantica. So I've taken a bit of a walk around the venue and I've just come to this sort of opening between the trees. And I've, I've not set up on an actual peg, I've just cast out with a singular rod. I've just been waiting to see if we can get anything. Oh, the rod twitches, it cracks off. We do have a fish on. Literally, we've just been holding this rod. We've just cast out into this corner here where it's nice and calm, hoping that we've got some carp uh, about and we have got a carp on. Literally, as I say, there's no peg here. We've just come to this opening and cast out with a singular rod, which is all you can do when you're not actually set up on a peg. You can't put um, a rod stand out. 
we've got a decent fish on. Feels pretty decent. A little bit surprised that we still got something on, but we have got a fish on and it feels good. Okay, so the fight continues here. Then at this little opening that we just randomly came to, and we cast out with this one individual rod. We've, the fight's been ongoing for a few minutes now. Well, hopeful we're going to get this thing in. Yeah, you start to turn over, losing energy. Get in there. Oh, look at that. That is an absolute monster. Get in. There has to be another boss. It is. We've got the weld. Literally, no peg, but we just cast out single rod. CR1 bottom bait once more. Just killing it on this run. 51 pounds and 5 ounces. An absolute tank of a fish. A little bit surprised to get this one considering the location. You can see here, look, there's no peg. Just at this little opening. And then we just cast out into the corner. Let's go to the lay of the lake. You can see top left corner. And we're in the tree line uh, area, as it's called. Just in the opening between the trees. So uh, perhaps give that one a go yourself if you, you get up to this corner. And uh, hopefully you'll be able to get a boss fish as well. We continued our walk around the lake and we're on to, I think, what will be our final peg of this trip. First fish on here. Kill him. Not a monster by any means. We can just be a bit more forceful to get this first fish in here at this final peg a nice common at 22 pounds monster red boil is on rod one 18 mil doing the job again more action then as we see another one of our rods crack off into the distance pulling line this feels like a good fish as well rod two has gone off but we are continuing to fight this fish it's another good looking one right here come on that started to turn over a little bit losing some gas pull this thing in and finish off this trip on a high if we can oh that is an absolutely another killer fish right there another tank it's the clown 62 pounds and 8 ounces again I've got to give it to rod number 2 to set up with the 18 mil CR1 bottom baits, just killing it once more. And an absolute tank of a fish secured uh, in the clown here at this uh, final peg. Once more, let's go over to the lay of the lake and you can see we moved around to Scotty's corner. And we're just out of the peg, just in front of you as you come into this area, casting out to the right into that corner and another boss fish secured on this amazing run here at Gigantica. Good fun guys. Absolutely love killing it on this run. A number of boss fish secured. And uh, yeah, it's just been amazing. Get out here, try some of these spots. I hope some of these spots help you and uh, you can try this setup as well. Good luck to you if you do give that a try. Uh, thanks for watching. And as always, thanks for riding along.